you guys had a really good effort against them yesterday. How did you see today's game? Uh, not good. Um, I think, you know, for the, the vast majority of the game, we got outworked. And um, you can't do that against anyone in this league, let alone a team like Chicago who has quite a few guys with NHL experience and, and uh, guys who are good players at this level as well. So, um, like you said in the question, it was just a matter of consistency. And tonight, the biggest issue was our work ethic. Now you guys come into a ga game with a game plan, as do they. Do you felt that it was? Do you feel like it was something that they were able to impose on you, or is it just that you guys just didn't adhere to what was your plan? I uh, just didn't adhere to uh, what was our plan. Um, you know what? They they play fast and they're a transition team, and and uh, we turned a lot of pucks over, and that fed into their game, and and uh, they buried us with it. Overall, now you guys have a week to kind of get back into practice mode, get ready for Iowa to finish up this homestand. What are you uh, looking to kind of build on? Um, honestly, I think we, we play a good system game. Um, you know, even nights like tonight where we don't get out work, we're, we're in the right spots and, and uh, we know how to play within our system. Um, I think this week will probably be uh, a good week to get our legs under us and it's kind of our last little break before uh, the last home stretch here. So it's going to be a grind. It's a matter of, um, you know, just staying sharp this week and making sure we're ready to go on Saturday. One thing the coaches mentioned is how this is tightens up as this type of at this time of year. Have you noticed that? Yeah. Um, every year I've played in this league, that's is what happens. Um, first month or two, it's kind of run and gun, and teams aren't really playing within their system. Um, guys are full of piss and vinegar, and then kind of the guys wear down and stay stay within the system the second half of the year, and it's a lot tighter game. There's not much room out there. Neutral zones hard to get through with speed and. Um, it's been like that for a long time. It's going to probably continue to stay like that. Lots of games uh, against Central Division opponents in the last stretch here, uh, and then on the end of that, double uh, back back to backs with some of the teams that are fighting to, for the playoffs behind you. Anything you can learn from this stretch that maybe you can take forward once we get to the postseason? Uh, you know what? You just can't take a night off. Um, doesn't matter what team you're playing in your division or in another division in the West. Here, everyone's everyone can play, and um, like we said earlier, everyone t tightens up the second half of the season. Um, I mean, it's we kind of know everyone in our division now. We know what to expect from each team. Everyone plays hard, and um, you know some teams are a little more laid back. Some teams are more run and gun. So um, nothing we can really learn. It's just a matter of sticking to our game. And when we play our game, I don't think anyone can play with us.